God wants you to know how to protect yourself from the devil. In Corinthians, it says we must be aware of Satan's evil schemes so that we may protect ourselves from them. So let's get into it. You have to remember that Satan and demonic spirits are smart and deceptive, and they blind the whole world and lead it astray. They're not going to come outright and try to get you to be a Satanist because most people are not that foolish. For Satan himself masquerades as an angel of light, and his servants masquerade as angels of righteousness. That's why the Bible warns of false prophets in wolves and sheep's clothing. For example, secular music. Secular music is so demonic and everyone is so deceived. If you ever take a moment to read the lyrics, look at the pictures, look at the music videos, it's right in front of your face. And when you're constantly taking this in, taking this in, it alters your subconscious mind and it permeates your soul. In Matthew it says, The eye is a lamp of the body. If your eyes are healthy, your whole body will be full of light. But if your eyes are unhealthy, your whole body will be full of darkness. You should not be watching horror movies either, or anything violent. And when you do these things, you are opening doors for demonic spirits and giving them legal right to put a foothold. For example, when you watch horror movies, you then have nightmares. That's because you open that door for those demonic spirits to enter. For example, when you fornicate, you get all the demonic spirits of your partner, and that is what a soul tie is. Every time you sin, you're opening doors for these demonic spirits to enter. And what you need to be most careful of is false Christians who are progressive and preach a false gospel because Satan masquerades as an angel of light. There are a lot of Christians out there saying, you know, it's fine. You don't have to follow all these rules. You can listen to secular music. You don't have to do all this. Just believe in God and you'll go to heaven. Even Satan believes in God. In Corinthians, it says, The God of this age, which is the God of the earth, Satan, has blinded the minds of unbelievers so that they cannot see the light of the gospel. You have to remember that broad is the way to destruction and many will find it, but narrow and straight is the way to heaven and eternal life and few will find it. So look around at what everyone is doing. Don't do that. <laughs> The Bible says, do not conform to the pattern of this world, but be transformed by the renewing of your mind. If you're confused, read the Bible. Please send this to people. I wish that I had seen this video earlier.